Today's episode of Crafting Under the Influence brought to you by Cuba Libre! Hi! Hey everybody, welcome to Crafting, Crafting Under, Under the Influence. Influence. My name is Paige. My name is Aubrey. I think I'm still drunk from last night. Is, <laughs> this is bottled rum and coke. I believe you mean a canned rum and coke. How long have these been around for? It's a fairly new product. It looks like it's super vintage. 8% alcohol. Oh baby. Uh, that's actually delicious. That's really refreshing. I like that. I do too. I'm not usually a big rum and coke drinker. I'm not either. But this might turn me into it. No. This is gonna go down so easy. This is gonna <laughs> go down real smooth. Good night. Uh, okay. What are we making today, Aubrey? We are going to take some thrift store glasses that we just got at, you know, the local Goodwill, and we're gonna make um, scented candles. This is great. Oh my God, I you're know. a genius. I got the brains in my cerebellum. We're gonna decorate the outsides of these glasses. This one already has some decoration on it, so we might not need to do anything to this. It looks expensive, but really it costs $2. So we have these, these paint pens that we used on those bags we made. Vendor Stift Beer East. And that's all you need to know about that. That's all you need to know. Step one is drink your drink. <laughs> Step one is drink your drink. Step two is decorate your glass. Thank you. <laughs> and we're using uh, that blue painter's tape stuff because we want to be able to take it off the glass easily. This doesn't look right. Let me see what Maybe other you should supplies do. I have. Ha ha. Let me do it. Oh. Starting over. <laughs> Guess what I'm bringing out. The Mod Pod! Oh my god, what? You're going nuts over here! I'm going crazy! So, who are you voting for? Alright, I'm Mod Podging. Send it over here. Feel free. When you trust Paige, magic happens. If really anybody wants to donate to get the one. Crafting Under the Influence Fund. <laughs> to get us a fire extinguisher. A you a stinguish. <laughs> <laughs> you should just have one in your apartment. I'm pretty sure it's the law. I don't see it. Do, 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 Is that ready? I don't know. Let's see. This is gonna look real cool. That look real cool or real dumb. Show the world. <gasps> well, nice. it's not off yet. We just got like these chunks of wax from Michael's. They're paraffin wax. So it has to be double boiled. So what we're gonna do is put it in this Pyrex bowl into the hot water. The Pyrex bowl has a spout, so we'll be able to pour it easily into our glasses. Alright, so just throw it in there. Okay. And then we'll see. When you have a candle, there's a wick that burns, right? And it has that little like doodaddy on the bottom that sits at the bottom of the glass. We take the little wick thingy that has the wick and the little stander upper on the bottom. Stander upper! A stander upper! That's the scientific term. Uh, you're gonna <laughs> wrap her around the chapstick. You can use a pen, you can use whatever, and you're gonna wrap it around so that it sits at the top of your thing so it stands up straight while you pour in the wax. Clearly we've been drinking while we've been melting the wax. I came in like a wreck! <laughs> we found some costumes and dress ups. Look at pretty little Bo Peep over here. Where are my sheep? Where my sheep go? <laughs> we are melting some wax. Melting the wax. Watch it liquefy. Melting the wax. What are you doing? What do they call these? I don't know, but flappy wing. Flappy. Yeah, okay. When do we add the cinnamon? Now? Uh, sure. Oh yeah. So we have like a little uh, essential oil. Oh, oh, oh. How much? I don't know. I'm just gonna do a little bit. Okay. Fresh baked cinnamon. Ow! I just smacked your cinnamon. You just smacked my cinnamon. Mm. Deliciousness. 
Oh, be careful. Oh, be careful. And it's heavy. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Okay, here we go. Oh, here we go. So I'm going to hold on to the stick thingy while I pour it. Okay. Sure it's ready. Woo! That's pretty. Will you pour it into mine, too? Sure. All right. All right, so now we have to wait for these to cool. Um, we can this probably. This one's already looking like it's cooling. It's starting to cool, yeah. This wick is being a little fickle, being a fickle wickle. So now that they're cool, Ish. you can see. They're cool enough to where it's not gonna slosh around anymore. To the touch, it's still warm, but you can pick it up and not burn yourself. Yeah, it's, you you know because it's all white. Right. It's not clear anymore. Right. So it's pretty cool. I'm gonna remove our little holder right there, and then just trim the wick. This is good. Look at my finished candle. I'm really happy with it. Yeah, this was a fun craft. Guys, you could awesome. totally make these as um, holiday gifts for all your loved ones. Yeah, put a little bow around it. Oh, wait, I already did. Subscribe. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you next time. Yes, on Crafting, Crafting Under, Under the Influence. Influence. Drink some Cuba Libre. Bye-bye. And leave us comments. Text 1 to 1-800-C-U-I-Etsy if you vote for yes, we should create an Etsy store. Yes. Text 2 to... 1-800-C-U-I-Etsy. If you vote no, we should not make an Etsy store. We'll tally up your votes and determine whether we should make an Etsy People store. People are actually going to <laughs> do that. That's not a real number, y'all.